hello guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video we are going to see how you can use permissions and ask for permissions in your application in flutter so let's start with our demo application so for that we have our demo application where we have just an app bar so first of all what we can do is we'll have our column and inside column we can have our list style okay so list type now we have we'll give it a title of let's say text and let's say camera permission okay and for the leading we can also give an icon icon start camera okay i will save the app and i can see our list style we'll have an on tap property for our list tile so now before that you can do is go to pub.dev and search for the permission handler go to installing copy these dependencies and install it in your system Go to pubspec.yaml, paste it here and install it in your system. Once it is installed, what you can do is for Android, you need to provide a set of permissions that is inside your main, inside your manifest file. You can, you have to write such like user permission, Android permission, Android name and you need to provide what kind of a permission you are accessing for for example if you are using location internet bluetooth camera recording audio external storage so you need to provide this okay then this is for the android part and for the ios part you can define it in your info.plist you can provide here like for accessing camera microphone etc okay so after that what you can do is we can simply go ahead and in the on tap of our list style we can have our status is equal to we'll have an async we'll wait and we'll have our permission dot camera dot request now here we will request for the camera and we will check if the status is denied we can again ask for the permission permission dot camera dot request else if the status is denied permanently we can simply open app settings that is the settings of your phone from where you need to give the permission okay we'll save the app now what i'll do is i'll simply tap on our list style and you can see if we have a permission pop-up okay so we will simply not allow it will ask again because we have wrote that if it is denied we will request it again okay so we'll request it now by saying yes okay similarly if you want to access the permissions for other requests we'll have our little style let's say we want to access our microphone permission okay we'll have our icon as mic and instead of camera we can simply use microphone dot request okay here too microphone dot request we'll simply save the app now we have our microphone we'll tap on our microphone you can see this it is asking for the access of microphone we will not allow again we will not allow 
and if I'm pressing it again, you can see it's getting open in our app settings. Okay. So from here we can allow, not allow. Okay. I'll simply disable our camera permissions. We'll go back to our application. We'll rerun our application as it's not working. Okay. Till that we will do is we will simply copy paste our list style and let's say you want to access for the permission of all the permissions let's say we can ask for both like camera and microphone permission okay we will camera mic and we will save the app so now here instead of this status writing like this request what you can do is you can simply await we will remove this now we will have our permission dot camera and our permission dot microphone and here we can use our request to we'll save the application now if you want to access both the permissions at a single time you can click on this button like this and now you can see it's asking for the camera first I'll allow it and then now it is asking for the record permission okay so this is how you can use the permission handler package to use and ask for the permissions 